Hey guys, oh what's up? I'm just sitting out in the car while Jason went in to get some drinks because we already went a grocery shopping, so yeah. But I got, let me see if it's on the bag. We went to GJ, not in that bag of course. And you know, we all know those fake pocket socket things. Like, I got this one for $4. Dude, it's a sloth with a llama. So, I was pretty stoked. Um, actually, Jason found it. He's like, well, I know they're cheap, but you're really going to want this. And I'm like, probably not. And then he showed me it was sloth. So, you know, I had to get it. Um, and Jason got these new cheetahs. Also, a case of um, Cheetos. That's really, really good. Um, but yeah, so we went grocery shopping and I'm literally just sitting here waiting for him. Because I'm ready to go home and eat lunch and take a nap -o. Um, I didn't get much time on my CPAP last night. Well, my BiPAP. I think I got about an hour and 40 minutes. Because I went to sleep at 2 and I was up at 5. So, I need to take a nap. Put my mask on for a while. So, yeah. That's pretty much what's going on today. Um, I am wearing a hoodie because it was cold, um, out here in Kentucky this morning, um, but the sun's popping out now, so it is, um, getting warm. So, yeah. So I just threw on some leggings, t-shirt, and hoodie, so. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, that's what's going on. Um... As far as other updates go, we have currently moved. Um, the situation is kind of wonky, but um, I will kind of just give you the low rundown. Um, Jason's ex-wife, um, which we were all really good friends. Um, his mother of his son. His son is like 18. Um, but, and he lived with his mom and everything. Um, well, she passed away. And she was 37, so she was really, really young. And, um, Stevens really never had to do anything for himself. So, it is a process. Um, but we moved in to an apartment. And, you know, it's just a lot of that going on. Um, going through her stuff and... You know, whatever he wants to keep, he keeps. You know, obviously, like, the clothes and stuff we're trying to get rid of and stuff for it. So, it's it's a process. Um, he stays in his room all the time, which he always has done that. He has a problem with, like, anxiety and stuff, just like Jason does. But, um, yeah, he's really had never had to do anything, like, for himself so it's I think adjustment for everybody um, and I kind of get aggravated with Jason because I have an autistic son who's 28 and he expects him to do more than his own son I'm sorry people are screaming in the parking lot so like yelling at her and she's like six or seven okay. um but yeah so like I said it's like a process and you know Jason needs to understand that if my autistic son can take out the trash put dishes in the dishwasher and do his own laundry that his son who's almost 19 years old is gonna have to learn to do that stuff as well um, I know right now he doesn't really eat that much. He comes down downstairs like maybe once a day, like at night usually. And he'll eat dinner when I cook dinner and stuff. But 
so this is fairly new for everybody so it's gonna take time obviously so yeah that's what's been going on so we had to move and my other son and his wife my granddaughter had taken over where we lived before and they have our cats because we can't have pets which sucks so and we're only like five minutes away so we go over quite a bit to visit um but anyway guys that's it for today's vlog so hopefully you enjoyed it and i will see you guys in the next video bye